Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to um, redirect people from one filter, which is Cheetah, into Pixel Perfect. Okay, so we have here my website, which is this one. Okay, which is phone number one with a domain connected. Okay, this is the my, this is my homepage. This is where I have everything here set up for my um for my business. Okay, but I want to use a feature on Picture Perfect, which is the contact form. Okay, that allows you to plot files. Okay, but if you have a reason to use Picture Perfect for any kind of feature that Pixel, that Cheetah doesn't have, you can also use this as an example. Okay, um, if you go into Picture Perfect, you can see that I already have a website created, which is this one, with a subdomain connected. Remember that subdomains are unlimited here on Builderall, okay? And you can see that I'm using the same domain that I have on Cheetah. Just click on the three dots here and connect domain and just type the name of the subdomain. Okay, for this example, it's contact.pastadelivery.ga. Okay, just hit save and you will be able to connect that subdomain to the website. Okay, if we go into my Pixel Perfect website, you can see that I have my, my contact form for this example. But if you're using Pixel Perfect for some reason, okay, you can also um, do, do this as an example. Okay, the next step is by going into my Cheetah website, okay, which is this one. But you can see that I don't have any header or any footer here because I'm using the global elements option. If we go into my Cheetah and go to edit website, and then we go to the left side of the panel, Global Elements. You can see that we have new options, which is header and footers. Headers, you can create headers to assign them into a website. Okay, so I can assign this header into my, my home page. Okay, so if we click on create new header, just type the name and you will be able to create this new header. And just click edit header. So you will be able to add panels or add any kind of um, things you want to use okay but i just use a blank panel with a menu and a logo okay you can see that i that i'm trying to recreate the same style that i have on picture perfect okay with the logo and the menu okay because you cannot take elements from here to picture perfect because they are different builders okay so i need to link this home page about services and project into the, the pages that i already Created on Cheetah. If we go to um, the home page Cheetah, just leave, you can see that I have my, my pages here thank you page, exclusive offer, courses pages. So I just have to link this menu into my pages by clicking on them and just comfort items. Okay, so let's say that I want to link my home page, okay, into my home page website. So I have to set link and click on home page. Open in the same tab, okay, and click on select, okay, save. I can also make this has a, a sticky heater, okay. Sticky heater is the one that if you scroll down, the, the heater will remain like on the same position, okay. So I can use the sticky heater on desktop, okay. The next step is by linking the contact us into my Pixel Perfect website. How can I do that? So I have to go into config items. And then go to contact us. So I'm gonna click on set link, and then I'm gonna type here HTTP. Okay. Then I'm gonna use contact delivery GA. Okay, which is the subdomain that I use on Pixel Perfect. Okay. Open in the same tab, and then click select and save. Okay. So once you click over here, it will be taken into my Pixel Perfect website, which is this one. Okay. But on Pixel Perfect website, I have to link back uh, the homepage about services and projects into my pages in Cheetah. How can I do that? So I'm going to click over here and go to Edit Menu Items. Here, I'm going to link my homepage into my Cheetah website, which is this domain that I'm using on Cheetah. Okay, open the same tab and then click OK. Okay, about services project, you have to do the same. But instead, you're going to go into your website. So let's say that I want to link services okay, with um, exclusive offer. Just an example. But just going to click over here and go to website. You can see that you will have the entire 
URL for the website and the page. So you have to just copy that, copy, go to Pixel Perfect, go to Services, and just put here the URL for that page. Okay, so it will be the exact the same, but here in Pixel Perfect, you have to enter enter the entire URL for the for the pages manually. Okay. I'm not gonna use contact us because we already are on the on the contact us page, but on Cheetah I will need a contact us so they will be taken into my Pixel Perfect page. The next step is by selecting the contact form, okay? But remember that I'm using the contact form for just an example. You can use the any type of um, things here that this, uh, the Cheetah doesn't have, but uh, I am able to select a file here so users can upload files so I can receive them via email. So I can go to comfort, edit, then I, I will type here the email that I want to receive this information that you, the users are entering here. The subject is basically to identify the contact form so the subject of the email will be this one. Okay, action after they, um, after they click on the bottom. Okay. It will be taken into my home page, which is the, the domain. Okay. Make sure to select everything. If you're typing URL, make sure to select web address. Okay. So you can put here the name of the domain. Make sure that also has this protocol here. Okay. Click on OK. You can also edit an automatic message that the user will receive into their email. Okay. You can click over here, put the name. Okay. Put the tag for the name and make sure to use cadastro email. Okay because this is where they're going to receive an auto reply by the system when they um when they click on the bottom okay the next step by going to a set a successful message that will say message was successfully sent or something like that uh, successfully sent something like that. I don't know confirm but that, that is up to you okay just click on save Save and publish. Okay, so let's try it out. Just by going and linking my, my menu on the Pixel Perfect and linking my menu here on Cheetah, I already have my contact us to Pixel Perfect and my, my Pixel Perfect home and services back to Cheetah. Okay, so let's do a test. If I go into my 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 um my domain which is pasta delivery, okay, pasta delivery domain. Okay, this is my home page. Okay, and if I go into contact us, the user will be taken into Cheetah, into Pixel Perfect. I'm sorry. So they will fill the details like Miguel Buderol. Okay, Miguel Buderol. Phone number B2EC3. I can click over here, we we'll plot a file, then we we'll plot an image like this. Confirm. Okay, perfect. I already plotted a file here. Click over here, run capture. Okay, F2 and QN. And instant access. So a message will appear and it will be taken directly into my Cheetah website. I can also go back to Contact Us. I can cl click on Home. It will be taken to Cheetah. I can go to Contact Us and I can click on Services. So I'll be taken to my other page with Services. You have to make sure that this page, which is Services, has the menu and the footer and the and the, the footer and the heater assigned. Remember that to assign heaters on the global elements that you created over here, you have to go into the page you want to assign that. Click over here, settings, and then you can choose uh, go to scroll down all over and you have these heater settings. So you can choose the heater for desktop and mobile, footer, desktop and mobile. Okay, you have to create all, all the elements. Another thing you have to keep in mind is that Pixel Perfect is not it's not as responsive. So if you go to the mobile version, you will see that the mobile version is empty. So I just have to drag and drop everything inside and try to recreate everything here. If you have more elements, you have to make sure to include those elements into inside of the frame of the mobile. Okay, so this will uh, be created like this. But if we go into Cheetah, you can see that if I go into the mobile, which is the home page, you will, you will see that it will it will be very different than editing on the mobile version on Cheetah.
on Pixel Perfect. Okay, so this is the heater. If we go back into my home page editor, which is this one, and we switch into mobile view, mobile view, I just have to recreate everything here. So you will see that I, I, I don't have any, any menu here, but if I click on save changes, go back to my desktop, save changes, I'm saving up the, all the changes that I did on the mobile. So if I go into my home page, which is this one, okay, I already have my contacts page on Pixel Perfect. If, if people on mobile click on the same menu, they will be taken into Pixel Perfect and they, 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 be, they will be visualizing the Pixel Perfect mobile version. Okay, so this is kind of like messy, but you will understand once you start creating your website that this is very easy to create.